I put myself in college football 25. Only problem is, I'm terrible at football. Which is why I am choosing the lowest possible overall you can do at 60. We're an underdog recruit technically, but that's really just a nice way to say we stink. I don't have the ideal height. I have below average arm strength, and I have below average speed. Not a lot going for me, but that's alright. It's the weakest of us that have the most potential. And because we're on a new journey, that's gonna mean new facial hair. Do we go with the mustache? I do like it. Do we go goatee? I like it less. How about we level up that mustache and go mutton chops? Yeah, the guy won't even look at the camera anymore. He's even disappointed in it. I don't think I could take this player seriously in this road to glory if I went that. Is that the Colonel Sanders goatee? You know what? Let's just go with a normal beard for now. We can get chaotic with facial hair later. I'm digging the eye black. It looks pretty cool. Let's just go with the one that's smeared all over my face. No pause. You know what I'm definitely not going to do is roll up the jersey. I do not have washboard abs like that. We're going with the normal jersey. I actually love the pants above the knee look. That's something new they brought to this game. I think it's cool. I don't know if it's very good for your knees, but I dig it. I do think it's cool you can place your towel basically anywhere. This looks like a tail coming out of my butt cheeks, though. That's kind of weird. Oh, local reporters covering my decision. Haven't you heard I'm kind of irrelevant? When I'm 60 overall, I probably need to get experience, so I think playing time should be my main thing here. Let's go for a fun campus. I'm in college after all. Let's party it up. Do I want to play somewhere with a strong home field advantage or play close to where I'm from? In my head canon, let's play somewhere close to where I'm from. So Madison, Alabama is in North Alabama. So let's keep it regional, either in Alabama or a surrounding state. And you see you got a bunch of different options here, but it does sort it out based on teams I would have. The biggest interest for you, see if I go to Northwestern, I would be a second string on their roster. I'd be on the bench pretty much everywhere else, which I kind of like. Let me sort by the one stars and see who's interested in me most. Jacksonville State's in Alabama. Maybe I go there. Ooh, East Carolina's got some really good jerseys too, but let's go to Middle Tennessee State. Feel like this could be a fun one. I'm sure they have good jerseys. I like blue as a main color. 81 overall is their starting quarterback. That is going to be a battle for us. Definitely can't go to Liberty with a 91 overall quarterback. That doesn't seem like a good decision for me. General Booty at UL Monroe. I can't take his job, you know. That's just too legendary of a name. Well, screw it, mate. I'm gonna have to be grinding no matter where I go, so let's go ahead and go Middle Tennessee State. MTSU, the Blue Raiders. Why does my guy look sad that he just committed here? Ooh, they got the wall basically from NCAA 06. That is a nice touch. How do I look in my jersey? Oh, that's a good decision. The blue looks very nice. We actually do have two skill points here. You see, different ones cost different things, so if I was trying to upgrade my speed, it's gonna cost nine skill points. That is so many, but let's upgrade IQ first. It's probably gonna be helpful only thing we can upgrade at this moment. But that immediately got me to 63 overall. Oh, offensive coordinator is hitting me up. Entire coaching staff is glad you're here. Oh, that went by so quickly, I couldn't even read it. And why is this profile picture just so zoomed in on his face? <laughs> Dylan, take it easy, man. Quick pointer, you earn coach trust by your in-game and in-practice performance. How you do in position battles and the decisions you make. All right, cool. Just excited for the year, coach, but please change the profile picture. It's giving boomer. This is gonna be so fun, man. We got the weekly agenda. You can focus on your academics, leadership, health, training, or your brand. Basically your NIL, increasing your fans. So it's up to me, what do I value as a player? You know, first thing I'm gonna forget about is my academics, because I'm a gunslinger. I don't even care care about school. I'm here to play ball. Or uh, ride the bench, I mean. It looks like leadership seems pretty important, though, because right now I am losing coach trust every week. I do not want that to happen. But if I don't focus on academics, I could be ineligible at some point, so I can't completely ignore that unless we do it for the views. I could also work on my training to get extra XP. And who knows what brand could get you. Probably huge potential with this, but it's a little more unknown. I think right now I want to focus on leadership, okay? It gives me a little bit of XP and a little bit of brand. Let's actually train a little bit too. We, we don't want to go all in on one, but you see every time you train, it knocks down your health a bit. Let's go another one in leadership and then we'll throw one into brand as well. So what, we got 245 fans right now. We're considered a local hero. And I'm starting to get some wear and tear on my arm from training. He says my right arm is losing three throw power. That's less than ideal. So the training is all mini game based and it says we got the option attack. Pretty much I just have to make the right reads and score as many touchdowns as possible. I'm just going to keep this one and I'm going to pitch that out to him. Let's see if he can score. Let's go. That seemed a little too easy. I'm on Heisman, but I guess it doesn't carry over. Oh, pitch it out barely. Okay, this is okay. It simplifies everything just so you can try and make the right reads, I guess. And just hand that off to him. Let him ride. 
all the way to the end zone. Yeah, we, we have not missed an opportunity yet. I mean, it tells me exactly what it's doing. I'll go out there and give the block, though. <laughs> oh, never mind. I'm tripping. All right, I'll just keep this myself then. I want to get some action here, too. I'll just outrun everybody. Woo! All right, that was a little too easy. We got the maximum level, so we're going to get the maximum coach trust here at 500. I'm sure it's going to be much more difficult in the actual game. Ooh, this is a cool little meter. Still way down on the bench. Just a lowly two-star freshman. Ooh, QB1 is messaging me. They're still adjusting room assignments because of some transfers, so it looks like we'll be rooming together this week. He tends to sleep over his alarm. I wonder what the real-life version of this dude is thinking right now if he sees this. Nick, let me know if you're watching this. This is probably pretty funny. We just got to let him know if we should wake him up for practice tomorrow. If we don't, he could oversleep and it could risking him going down the depth chart, but I don't want to win based on that. I want to win the job with my talent. I'm going to agree to help him out. Ooh, my leadership went up. See, you show respect to your teammates. They're going to respect you back. But we're very close to upgrading leadership again here. All right, so now we're no longer losing coach trust every week. That's probably where we want to be right now. Should probably be getting some XP though. We're, we're just such a low overall, but I don't want to get too injured. I'm losing 13 throw power. Sheesh. If I ever do get playing time, I should probably pay attention to that more. Let's try the target passing one. I'm glad it gives me options of what I can do. Position your QB and time your pass to destroy as many targets as possible. Got it. So I guess I should go over here. Oh, a little off the mark. So I get nothing. I'm not able to retry this either. So I'll have to figure it out. All right. We got through one target. Oh, threw it a little too early. See, this one kind of annoys me because I feel like I'm making decent throws. All right, how about I just do that and just lob it every time? That's probably the move. Wow, we got nothing for that. I am not doing that one again. I failed miserably. Oh, we got the pandas for my first ever game. I'm probably not going to be getting on the field here, but that's still very cool. 69 offense. <laughs> nice. Our impact players are tied in. Holden Willis, 83 overall, 88 catching. Holden looks damn good. Welcome to Murfreesboro, Tennessee and Johnny Red Floyd Stadium, home of the Middle Tennessee Blue Raiders. And Raider fans have been clamoring to get this one started all week. We've got a terrific matchup for you today. Rich in pageantry and tradition. And wow, there's nobody in the stands. Oof. Probably more Panda fans out there than actual Blue Raiders fans. Johnny Red Floyd Stadium. So we've already got the high risk of injury because I've just been training too much, I guess. Will I ever see the field today? I think I'm the fourth string on the team or something. Doesn't look like it, but we are going to kick the Panda's butts. Doesn't help that Nick is having an incredible game. We dropped 41 points on him. Why am I dapping anybody up? Does anyone even know who I am? Dang it, Nick. I helped you out and you score five touchdowns. Respect, sir. But I'm trying to steal the job out here. Maybe I gotta be playing a little bit more dirty. No, I'm just kidding. Show respect to people. That's how we'll do it. How far away are we from even challenging the next starter? We're down in here at 446 Coach Trust. Oh my goodness. The backup quarterback, Luther Richieson, is at 14,000 Coach Trust. Oh my, we might not play a single down here in year one. I guess the better news is we're at QB3, but oh my, we have a long way to go. But well, we're gonna keep on keeping on. Oh, Holden Willis is talking to me. You're one of the impact players. This is like the cool kid in school, man. Just a heads up, it's usually custom for freshmen to carry the seniors' pads out to the practice field. All right, Holden, don't be hazing me now. I was looking up to you until you disrespected me. It says I'm gonna earn two energy for doing it. And for this week, you gotta clean the lockers. I mean, again, the profile picture is intimidating here, Holden. Oh, wait, this is gonna cost two energy. Obviously, because I gotta clean the lockers, I gotta carry their stuff. I'm sorry, Holden. I'm standing up for myself. I don't care what this affects anywhere else. Probably gonna hurt leadership. Yep, leadership decreased. Seniors are not pleased. And now now your teammates respect you considerably less. Look, sorry. Hazing's not cool, man. I don't dig that. Karen Jones, my academic advisor, once again, nightmare fuel in the profile picture. If you ignore studying, your GPA will plummet. Eh, we'll see about that. I'm gonna rebuff it. I came here to ball. We won't be talking much. All right, I didn't want to be disrespectful to her. Ricky Slick's Barbershop. We're a barbershop here in town. We want you to record a video for us. Uh, it scrolls up too quickly. That's my complaint with this. This is our proposal for a three-week contract for for the cost of one energy up front. Medium boost a leadership meter up front, but it's gonna cost me one energy every week. I'm gonna take that deal. My first ever NIL sponsorship. Let's do it, Ricky Slick's Barbershop. Your teammates appreciate your gifts. You'll receive a moderate boost to your leadership. Nice. See, this is already pretty fun. I like this gameplay loop. I'm not even like playing any of the games and I'm having fun messing around with this. So this is just passing. I gotta score as many times as possible. I guess I just have to stay in this circle. Oh, that's going to be a bad pass. Almost intercepted. That's not a great start for me. Let's just take what they give me. Yeah, this guy's wide open. Nice throw. 
I like this better than the option when I can actually be a quarterback. All right. We're going to hit this guy over the middle. Perfectly thrown. We're getting closer to the end zone. Let's try and lead him with that pass. Diving. What a catch. We're getting the hang of this. Wait for him to get open. There we go. Ooh. Oh, after the catch. Oh, he's so open. There we go. And this guy is catching everything. I only got the bronze, though, so I can't say I really cooked him, but I'm still getting coach XP for that. I really do like how they made the practice just mini games, so I'm in and out of it very quickly. Because kind of playing the old practices in NCAA 14 got a little bit stale after a while. Okay, so if I get to influencer, I think I'm going to be getting a different NIL deal, so that would be pretty neat. Feels like a mystery box of what you could get out there, too. I like the give and take of every other option here. It says the top three are all about managing things, and then the two on the bottom are really about upgrading stuff. But if we get our leadership extremely high, I feel like we're going to start getting coach trust and I need to be getting on the field. That's going to be my focus right now. Oh boy, but we got Ole Miss on the schedule. We're probably going to get blown out quickly. Oh yeah, we're on the road. We're at Ole Miss. They are about to stomp us. I do like the Ole Miss powder blue jerseys. Those look so clean. Unlikely that I see the field today unless some chaotic injuries happen. And here we go. We're not, not even at halftime and it's 28 to zero. They're up by four scores and they're not stopping. Yeah, that was a complete blowout. 31 to zip. Exactly how we thought it would go. Ooh, not the best day for Nick here. 166 yards, no touchdowns. Oh, but he's running the ball well. Dang it, he's a field general and he's running it. Ooh, it looks like because I only have medium leadership, the composure is minus 15 too. And we're not even getting times one the amount of team XP we should be getting. So I really need to be a better leader than this. And obviously if I'm not training, I'm not getting better in my overall. And boy, I've still been ignoring my academics. Training is the most expensive, but we got to do it every week, I think. At least once. One into local hero, then one more into leadership. Uh-oh, <laughs> the academic advisor's coming knocking. You have one of your first big tests over the year in your economics class this week, and our office is available for assistance. Are you going to come in to study? I probably do need to study because I haven't, but I'm gonna not do it. <laughs> I'm gonna risk it all. Nah, I ain't coming in. This is probably gonna be awful for my grade point average. Hasn't changed yet. We're definitely gonna get the results next week, aren't we? And we have an exam in four weeks. Oh, we are in trouble. Anyways, let's keep training. Oh, leadership's going down. That's not what you want to see. <laughs> Karen, she's back. Well, I don't know if you saw your test grade, but you tanked it. You should have studied. You have your midterms in a few weeks. They're on week eight. Don't procrastinate. Karen is definitely losing her patience with me. She doesn't even have a profile picture anymore because of it. GPA is taking a small hit. Oof. We're down to a 2.6. I think if you go below a two, you're at risk of being academically ineligible. That's probably the warning sign is like, look, buddy, you're gonna have to study at some point. I'm just clueless. Sorry, mate. I want coach trust. Ooh, we're in the high. Looks like our NIL deal just finished. So I'm not sure what that really plays out for us. I still don't have that many fans. I'll focus on my NIL when I start to play more games, I think. Right now, I'm still a nobody. Maybe you need a little caffeine, or maybe the sheer energy of this match will keep you wide awake. <laughs> the sheer energy of this matchup with no one here. <laughs> I have been to the Liberty Bowl Stadium before. Saw a bowl game there. Been ages though. Oh yeah, Memphis is way better than we are at this moment. Oh my goodness, I didn't expect it to be a six touchdown difference. All right, now we're starting to crawl our way back. This one is well over though. Oh my goodness, wait. Not so fast, my friend. We're down by a touchdown and we still lose. But what a comeback. Only a seven point loss after all of that. Five receiving touchdowns. We couldn't cover that guy. He did it on six catches too. Were they just throwing deep balls the entire game? Wait a minute. Nick is that dude. 512 passing yards, five touchdowns. I don't know if this guy's ever going to lose his job when he's playing like that. Update on the coach trust. I'm up to 1800. So this is okay. We're making slow progress. Eventually these guys will age out anyway, right? That's the dream. I thought I was going to be gaining passive bonus to coach trust every week, but it still says zero. Well, that's kind of sad. Maybe I'm gaining extra XP. XP, composure is better. So I'm an excellent leader. I've got the clear-headed ability now, but I really was hoping for the coach trust part of it. Well, offensive coordinator is coming to hit me up. Which of these coverages involves four deep defenders? It's going to be quarters. Quarters equals four. Hitting me with the tough questions here, Dylan. Which personnel group refers to having one running back, two tight ends, and two wide receivers? That is 
12 personnel, I think. Which of these concepts put the linebackers in a high-low conflict? That's probably going to be the drive concept because you got two routes intersecting over the middle. So that's specifically for the linebackers. That's when we'd be my guess. Indeed, the drag and the dig. Exactly how I described it. Boom, three for three. Coach trust has been increased because of that. And coach trust is what we need more than anything right now. Oh, but our exam is in one week and I haven't studied even a lick. And I'm not doing it now. They can't keep me from training. Oh, I got a severe risk of injury in my leg. I don't think I can look away from that. <laughs> severe is pretty crazy to see. I don't think I need to jump into the game against Louisiana Tech. We know I'm not playing. QB3, it's just not happening. Oh no, I must have bombed my exam because I am now ineligible. Karen is back and she is not happy. <laughs> well, your midterm results are in. You got a D plus, a D minus twice, <laughs> and an F. I checked your GPA to see how big of a hit you took and prep better for finals. Clear headed deactivated. Oh, wow. Ineligible is a tough sight to see. So I couldn't play the game if, even if I wanted. Now, I don't think I ever had a two GPA, but oh boy. So it sounds like I'm never going to be playing unless I get these grades up. They can't stop me. I'm training. All right. Never, now that I'm ineligible, it's probably actually smart to start studying for the first time. Oh, and it barely does anything. Oh, wow. You got to study a lot. Oh, I wish I would have started that earlier. We are in danger. Let's socialize a little bit. Get my spirits up. Probably pretty sad about being academically ineligible. Just straight up suspended studying a zillion times in a row. I only studied this week and I'm still underprepared. <laughs> my first season is a total wash. Oh, we got a classmate here. Hey, Drew, we're in the same class on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Found this PDF online with all the answers to your upcoming geology tests. Oh, am I going to be cheating on my test here? Do you want me to send you a copy? I know football players are super busy. You know what? I'm down bad. Let's use the answers. Can't say I didn't cheat at least once in college, you know? GPA has increased. Thank you, Parker. You're the GOAT. I'll, I'll get some touchdowns for you if I ever end up playing a game. Probably won't be this year, though. Oh, wait a minute. I wish I would have known this a long time ago. The academics, the coach trust is being boosted by it. I wonder if the passive impacts for leadership for coaches trust would be more of a thing when you're actually on the field playing. Says it's main action is for team building. So why did I focus on that first when I uh, can't really be much of a team when I'm QB3 on the roster? Can't be socializing when I'm studying though. I'm hitting the books here, boys. Nerd mode activated. I do like that you can see your whole roster here. This is cool. I mean, Nick is the fourth best player on the team. Was this a bad decision to choose for my school? Maybe, but we're gonna work our way through it. Karen is back. Please don't yell at me. I want you to know that your professor discovered that you cheated on your most recent exam and gave you an automatic fail on it. Oh, Oh no, it immediately backfired. Dang it, Parker. Oh, GPA taking a big hit. This is what I get for trying to study. My GPA is 1.4. Oh my. Maybe that's a life lesson. You can't cheat your way through it. Well, that exam is in three weeks. We're going to be prepared, I tell you. All of my time has been spent on it. It's Karen again. Ah, oh, Karen, every time you say something, I get a little worried. I says I'm academically suspended this week per your records. You'll need to be in the study hall this entire week starting tomorrow at 7 30. They, they have put their foot down. Mandatory study hall. Says we do get a bonus at the end of it, though. Man, I've been suspended twice already. I messed around and I found out. Well, it says I'm prepared. All right. Well, I guess it already took my energy by default. Well, you got your final exam results back. Straight A's. Remember that you need to finish some outstanding work for a few classes before the end of the year. You got it, Karen. Miss blank screen profile picture. I know I've been a problem child this year, but I'm glad we could make it through at the end. I thought I was going to fail and have to retake my freshman year. And now I don't have to focus on studying. We have all these extra points elsewhere to spend. Let's just keep training. I mean, we're getting absolutely ruined by this. Keep powering through, champ. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger or it makes your GPA worse. Our freshman season has flown by. KJ Jefferson wins the Heisman with UCF. That's crazy, but good for him. <laughs> oh my, all conference USA. I didn't play a single down. That seems like a bug. Even my guy's face looks like he's unimpressed. Hey, we made it to the RL Carriers New Orleans Bowl against James Madison. Six and six on the air. Let me, let me go check out the season stats. We know I got absolutely nothing. I didn't play a single down and Nick is still balling out. 30 touchdowns, five interceptions, 3,300 passing yards. Not even the backup got many reps. I, he only threw two passes. Nick also had 400 rushing yards and three touchdowns. Basically a one-man team. Oh my gosh. Javante Sherman, 1,100 receiving yards, 11 touchdowns. I wish I was out here playing with these guys. They look good. Looking at the college football 
playoff rankings, it looks like UCF is number 12. Kentucky at number two is a surprise. Yeah, UCF got the buy-in in the playoff. I guess that's why KJ Jefferson's winning in the Heisman. Interesting teams in here. Rutgers is incredibly surprising. Finally, I've got enough skill points to upgrade my speed. We all know speed goes burr. And that's only to get it up to 83. Man, that took a long time. Basically an entire season. I don't know if that's worth it. We should probably focus in on our accuracy and our awareness. At least until we start getting onto the field and getting some actual experience. Right now, we're not making a lot of progress. We're not really attacking everything in an intelligent way. But that's probably why I should have gone to class. Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Big Easy. Today in New Orleans, Louisiana, Caesar Superdome, home of the RNL Carriers New Orleans Bowl. I'm actually sitting on the edge of my seat trying to see if we win this bowl game. I have not contributed a single bit this season. The only thing I've contributed is me skipping class and cheating on tests. But it looks like we're going to win this game. Wow, we're really pulling away now. We get a bowl game victory. Well, I, I really shouldn't say we. I should say the team did, not me. But I'll still go congratulate them anyways. I don't know why they're patting on my head. I didn't do anything. Nick is the one who threw for 400 yards and five touchdowns. Well, that's the end of my freshman season. I'm probably technically redshirted since I never played a game. So I guess I retain my freshman season. I'll just be a redshirt freshman. Peeking at the college football playoff bracket. Michigan versus Georgia in the final, and Michigan takes it all. It is at this point where you can decide if you want to enter the transfer portal. I'm not done here at Middle Tennessee. State. I haven't even played yet. Already onto my second season and I've barely improved at all. I'm not messing around this season though. I'm not going to be playing around with my academics. I'm going to make sure I go to class at least once a week. Okay, maybe twice a week. And then I'll be training every week as well because I got to get my skills up. We'll throw the final one into brand. Just slowly pick away at it. We got almost 2,000 fans now. Oh, that's cool. It does redshirt you if you don't play at all in your first season. So we still have four years of eligibility at our disposal. I love that. Luther Richen is now the starting QB, but he's 81 overall. It looks like Nick moved on to somewhere else. Whoa, Nick is at Georgia now. Good for him. I mean, he was having a great season at Middle Tennessee State. Hey, good for him. We're definitely not going to be competing for championships right now. Oh yeah, love riding the bench. A new year and I'm still not seeing the field. <laughs> How long will we go without actually? actually getting some gameplay. Coming down to the wire, we actually ended up winning it. We're 1-0. Ah, oh. oh, dang it. Luther's pretty good too. 308 passing yards, two touchdowns. Wait a minute. We actually have some news. I am about to be able to challenge the second string quarterback. He is 69 overall. Nice. But we're soon going to be having a position battle. Things are happening. Keep getting that coach trust. I will take all I can get by studying. Oh, but we're losing coach trust by having low leadership. I can't be having that. I didn't realize I was holding myself back there. You got to be well-rounded. I'm at 4,822. He's at 4,800. Oh, now the position battle. So as long as you get enough to challenge him, then it comes up. So I think you have to win two out of the three mini games, and then you can move up the depth chart. Trying to go from QB3 to QB2. I'm so ready for this. Dodge the projectiles. Got it. Just trying to hit as many of these as possible. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of it. Move up in the pocket. Oh, we completely missed that. Dodge that. Easy mode. Oh, Oh, and I got hit by the thing. I'm getting sacked twice. I'm losing a lot of points here. There's no like sound that pops up when you get hit by those things. You just see it happen. The big giant tennis balls. We only got bronze. What did he get? So I guess we did enough. Oh, option attack. He's in my house now. Say, I I'm going to clean up on this one. Never failed to get gold. I'm coming for you, Willie. Said, I'm not really sweating out this one. We already know we're going to accomplish this. They just don't even challenge you at all. I guess this is all just meant to be a long tutorial of sorts. Well, we got gold. We just need to not blow it now, which I don't think we could. <laughs> Seems like every time it's a touchdown. Scramble survive. It's one we have not done before. Okay, roll out here. So I can still scramble around. I just got to find a guy open in the end zone. Oh, and I don't even get it off. So we did get sacked, but we got the bonus ones. Collect those points. Throw it over here and it gets swatted away. We got to complete one of these passes. Thankfully, I am an improviser, so I'm able to do this with ease. Ooh, dancing around him. Get that bonus. Throw it to the corner. Oh my, how do you drop that one? I know it was behind you, but still. Surely catch that. There we go. Finally, we complete a pass. This is our final rep. We got to do it here. 
Throw it short, and he's got it. Battle one. There we go. We did it on the final rep. We're QB number two. Now, it looks like he failed the first two, so maybe we would have been fine. It looks like he beat me on the scramble survive anyway, but it added the drama, and Karen's got her profile pick back. She must be happy to see me again. I'm no longer a disappointment. We're gonna study even more. Leadership going up too. I'll worry about my XP later on. Hey, Karen said I did a nice job. I got a good grade on my quiz. She's like, don't forget about the midterms too, though. Don't worry, Karen. I'm a changed man. Increase in my GPA. Fan favorite activated. We must be super high in our GPA now. Yep, there it is. 3.8 GPA. Feels good. So we can take our focus off of that for a second. Let's go back to training a little bit. Need those skill points. And then just a little bit into our brand. Some leadership could not hurt. All about balance now. I'm no longer messing around. I'm not just the new freshman on campus who doesn't know what he's doing. Whoa, our fan favorite got upgraded to silver. We must have crushed it on our exam there. Or maybe we're just staying in the prepared state. I guess that helps. I mean, I don't even need the abilities yet. I'm not even playing games, but I do like the coaching trust. It's helping us slowly but surely move our way up the ranks. Midterm results are in straight A's. We knew it. We were prepared this time. We studied as much as we possibly could. 4.0. Love that. And we know that the higher GPA increases the bonus to coach trust every single week. That's massively valuable. The fan favorite keeps upgrading every week. I've got it up to gold. Oh, Audrey, my classmate. Hey, I know the players have curfew but my friends are throwing a party this week. It starts at midnight. You should come. Whoa. I seen someone on Twitter post the overly eager response. It gets you blocked. Let's give a cool response and go to the party. Yes. I'm down. <laughs> Are we sure that's cool? I guess that's all it is. Follower increased. I could use those followers, you know. My coach is hitting me up. Hey, Morris. He calls me by my last name. I just got sent a picture of you out past curfew from last week. Are you sure you're saying the rules apply to your teammates, but not to you? Do you really think that's a good way to make an impression your first year? Well, coach, I've been here for two years. Am I just that irrelevant? He doesn't even know I've been here for two years. Coach trust has decreased. No, we've been trying to grind on that. We got an exam in five weeks. We'd better be studying. I no longer mess around, okay? We've got seven points to upgrade my player. I really need to start spending here. So I spent some on IQ. Gonna spend some on accuracy as well. You know what? Let's go more on accuracy. Wow, 88 deep accuracy now. That's pretty good. Too bad I don't have the throw power to match it. Hey, but those upgrades has got me to 70 overall. Oh my gosh, Luther is in sight now. Maybe by the end of the year, we could challenge him, but he is also a junior. He could leave for a new job. Surely we did good on this test, right? We've been studying so much. All Bs, I'll take it. GPA is 3.8. Heck yeah. Super worth. Caden Salter wins the Heisman Trophy this year at Liberty. Some pretty surprising Heisman Trophy winners in this simulation. And we're going to the Snoop Dogg Arizona Bowl presented by Gin and Juice. This has got to be new. I had no idea this was a thing. Oof. Luther did not have nearly as good of a season as Nick did. 3,000 passing yards, 21 touchdowns, 8 picks. I'm really surprised we didn't get a chance at least once this season to try and challenge for the starting job. We have been grinding 10,000 coach trusts. We're still almost 300 behind Luther. I can just fully focus on training right now, even though it's got my legs in severe danger. Second bowl game of my career, and I still have not played a single game yet. We're about to end my second season too. Maybe I should have transferred out, but I'm not quitting. I'm gonna try. Wow, we have won two bowl games, and I have not contributed a single thing. Just a hype man on the sidelines. And Luther had a great game. 279 yards, one touchdown. I mean, not the greatest record this year. We finished seven and six, had a three-game losing streak near the end, but we continue to win bowl games. College football playoff results. It looks like Alabama's winning another national title. I see Auburn made it down there. They even beat Georgia, but loses to Cal in a one-point differential. Pretty fun bracket here. I mean, Temple is crazy on here, but I'm sure we're going to see some crazy stuff with the 12-team playoff in real life, too. I do have the option of entering the transfer portal, but I'm going to stay put. I'm going to keep trying. I'm going to win this dang job. What we really need is just to get on the field, and then we can really show the world what we can do. I should really be going to class two. We know what happens when you don't study. I'm going to keep upgrading, trying to shore up my deficiencies here. IQ is the only thing that costs two points, so I'm going to keep spending there. Oh my gosh, we have more coach trust than Luther. Is this finally our time in our red shirt sophomore season? We can challenge QB1. This has been such a long journey to get to this point. Our coach, we have a brand new one, Kevin Claude Felter. He said he wanted to start here. Well, you're going to get a chance to prove it. Thank you, Kevin. I am not going to waste my opportunity here. All right, looks like we have the scramble survive one. We've done decently at this one. I know it's a little bit challenging. It's one I usually lose. So we're going to try and open up this guy into the corner and it's swatted down. I was trying to lob it over. You're supposed to scramble out. I'm collecting these points if I can. Can I get away from him? 
Just barely, that was stressful. Trying to get those 500 points. Just lob it in there. He got it! Oh my goodness, there was a lot of traffic over there. This is definitely one of the more stressful ones. Come on, keep running. He's so open. Barely getting it away. Oh my goodness. Okay, this one is definitely hype. Set my feet and make a beautiful throw. Be patient. And then you take off. She lets your blockers get in a better position. Throwing it now in the corner. Oh my goodness. We got gold. We won that first position battle. But now we got to do the option attack, which we can probably just skip this one. We've seen me do it a zillion times. We know I'm going to get it done. Just watch the running back go in the end zone. Oh yeah, we crushed the second one. So I think all we had to do is win two of the three. And that means all we got to do is just play this one out, basically, I think. Why is that one going into the sky? I don't know. We've done it! We have won the starting job! This is year three of my college career, and I have not even played a single down yet. My Baker Mayfield-looking ass is about to get some playing time. 1,500 coaching points, and we dominated them in every single drill. Take that, Luther. Well, now that I'm the starter, I think I should be increasing my influence a little bit, but I do need to be studying for my exams as well. I don't want to go down. I'm going to keep it at unprepared for now, and then continue on in my brand, because I'm about to be starting. Wow, did we jump in an overall now that I'm the starter or is it just generally our team is better? I'm kind of curious what we're working with at other positions because I imagine a lot of players have aged out now. We have a 77 overall running back, Willie Yaboa, Garrett Orlando, Ethan Kreit, Josh Evans, Tyson Resper. I'll try to learn these names as we go. Don't have that legendary tight end like we had in year one, but we got Brody Benke. We'll turn him into a legend. And Mac DeMarco. Crazy. I'm technically third in overall on this depth chart, but I've just stolen the starting job. I'm going to remember this game forever, man. Can you believe it? My first career start in my redshirt sophomore season, but it's going to be on the road. Oh, this is going to be tough. The Edwards Stadium home to the thundering herd of Marshall and one of the toughest places to play in all of college football. What an exciting matchup we have in store for you this afternoon, built around the pageantry, tradition, and everything that makes college football great. It's not a completely packed house, so maybe the, hopefully the stadium post won't be anything too crazy. Here we go. First ever time on the field. Do I look lost? Wow. Feels surreal to be out here. Not a huge fan of the camera, though. This is a little too zoomed in for my liking. How about this far back? They're going to open this drive. Let's try to target this guy over here. And wow, they just pressed us up. Incomplete pass. I cannot change the play at this level. So RPO screens. Make sure we don't throw a pick. He's open on this side. He makes the connection. Going to get some after it. Third down. I'm not even being stressed by the stadium pulse. Okay. He looks open over here. Whoa. Did he get it? First down. Told you I'm locked in. I've been waiting for this moment, man. Oh, we're going to take off. Oh, we're trying to at least. That guy was running off the edge. That's probably on me, not making an adjustment at the line. Definitely run this ball, try and get me some yards back. That's a good carry. Making this more manageable on third down. I do not want PA crossers right now, though. I cannot audible, but I can hot route. That's about all we can do. Let's see what these new pass protection things we got here. I think that guy's the mic. Let's go max protection, just quickly. Oh my gosh, the running back did not block at all. Well, first possession does not net points. Try to do better this next time around. I see cover three. I wish I could audible, but not at this point in my career. Do not have that kind of coach trust. Ooh, dangerous throw. He's still going to catch it. Let's go hurry up. When we get a play like level sale, I'm going to use it. No, wait, they immediately switched the play. I kind of like that. So you can't abuse the same one over and over. Oh, barely getting it away. Almost. It is intercepted. Oh, horrid throw right as I was getting sacked. Wow, that's tough. Coach is not going to be happy about that. I'm losing 40 coach trust. The thing is about this one is the other quarterbacks on roster are also gaining coach trust. So if I lose too much, I could be benched. But thankfully, I have a little bit of breathing room from winning the position battle. We're getting whooped right now. 14 zip. I am cold. Yeah, look at this. Absolutely freezing. I get this close camera when I'm just handing it off. Oh, he's gone. That'll be a first. Maybe we just run the ball more. Play changes remaining. How do I even change it? Oh, I pressed triangle. I, I can't read. Sorry. I'm going to use all 20. Do the work for me, running back. Shock H option. This looks fun. Let's go back to a passing camera. I, I want to roll to the left, so I'm going to switch my protection to slide over to the right because that defensive end has been terrorizing me. And find this open. Man, it worked. I don't really know what I'm doing effectively with the pass protection yet, but I, I do kind of like it. Willie again getting the first down. Running the ball well. It's fun to actually have gameplay again. Really loving this. Going right back to him. Oh, but the gap closes quick. 
I'm totally fine running the ball often. I mean, just get us in rhythm. I'm all about winning here, at least at this point in my career. I'm there behind you just in case you fumble it. 10 carries, 46 yards. That's pretty good efficiency. But now that we're going to be throwing it, let's look around and see what we got. Hmm. Looks like too high. Maybe this post could work if I just have enough time. That's really the thing. Let's ID the mic. Let's put it on that guy. And I'm probably going to roll a little bit to the right. So let's slide that way. Oh, did not have enough time. I should have stepped up. That's on me. Heisman is no joke in this game. You really got to come to play. We'll just take the underneath. Oh, that one's batted away. Will they take me out here? Yep, looks like they will. I can't even watch the play. That is one annoying thing about this. So we do get the field goal at least. Okay, we're going to try and test this seam. I see cover three. Oh, oh, I was going to try to take off. I bailed on it. Had guys open over the middle. That one is also on me. Everybody, slide to the right. Actually, we're going to send the... I wanted to send the tight end on the seam. He was open, and I'm just going to get sacked way back here. Trying to learn this systems. The coach trust is in the dumpster. Coach just wants to give up on the drive after that. I don't blame you. Oh my goodness, does he have a lane? Okay, yeah, we should definitely be running the ball more if he's going to get his yards like that. 17-3, but coach is calling four verts for me. It doesn't look like it's going to work against this kind of defense. I'll just throw it quick. There we go. Getting this hurry up. We got 28 seconds. Okay, it's another like four verts variation. I'm going to drop it to the running back. Just trying to get rid of it quick. Bad decision by me. I should have probably done something downfield or out of bounds. Oh, just throwing that into coverage and he caught it. Wow. Okay, we're still cooking. You staying in block running back. Everybody else just go deep. Take a chance while we got it. Bat it down, but eight seconds left. We can take a second to think about this one. Oh, the stadium pulse is enough to disrupt us. I don't hear a damn thing. Over the middle. That's enough for the first. Wait, they're going to pull me. Yeah, they're going to try and kick the field goal. Shouldn't they let us spike it first? Yeah, we don't even get a field goal. Okay, that is very, very strange. We definitely should have grabbed the field goal there. Or at least tried it. I, I didn't even see it happen. That is one annoying thing. I want to see the plays. Oh, wait, I got a block attempt. I get XP for that. Oh, yeah, I'm going to be throwing my body around then. Now we got read option. Oh, definitely made the wrong read. Lose big yards. Yeah, coach is not happy with that. Let's switch up this play. Let's go slot fade this side. Oh, dang it. We had man coverage with the fade route, but I just didn't have time. I got to do better with the blocking. This has been an absolute disaster of a debut. Maybe I'm not deserving of this opportunity. I'm going to full slide this way. Did we beat him? Is this a chance? Pass the linebacker. We called it at the line. We set it up and we finally score my first ever touchdown. Just lobbed it over him. We made the right decisions at the line. I love that you have the option to control the blocking schemes. You can hot route players even right from the get go. That is the really fun part about this mode right now. Oh, heck yeah. You can actually motion players out. This is cool. Send them out that way. Is this man coverage? Is that slot going to be open? Give them space. Batted down. Safety was on top of it. Uh, you, you'll notice a lot of my favorite things to do is just send nine routes. Uh, that's definitely a bad ball. I knew it, but I, I just try to commit to something, and that's going to be fourth down. Gosh, he loves this specific play. Uh, we're going to have to take off. There. There's a lot of space here for me. I'm going to cut around this way. And that'll give us a big first down. But I do like the difference in stadium pulse at different environments. Let's check this down to the running back. Just getting it away. Woo! Oh, coach is calling the all goes. I'm like in circle, I'm like in triangle, and I'm like an X. And it looks like B's going to be my man. Who's my first read, and he's gone. Oh, but he gets tackled first and goal. RPO read flat. I like this one. Just looking at the tight end, seeing if he gets open. I'm going to throw it his way. He's turning upfield. It's going to be a touchdown. Two passing touchdowns in my debut. Over 200 passing yards. We're coming back in this game. Another RPO. These could be fun. It looks like he wants me to throw to square. It wasn't open, but I tried to throw, and he still caught it. Nice. They were pressing us up. That was probably a bad decision. Probably should have just handed that off, but we're still moving. None of us are perfect. Oh, definitely not me. I really want to go in the hurry up. We're down by eight points. Do not give up on this game. Please get us the ball back. Okay, we did get it back. We still have all three timeouts. I'm going for the underneath route here. Okay, two-minute warning. That's a new thing in college football. It's going to take some getting used to. Uh, Coach has really abandoned the run. I mean, it's what has got us into a position where we're still competing here. I'm just trying to get rid of it. Yep. Tight end screen. That's not really what I want in a situation like this. Fine with a 
very vertical concept. It's easy for me to read. I'm gonna try and step up in the pocket and try and to scramble out, but they break off and sack me. Seven sacks. Man, I thought it was gonna be an improviser and be able to run around a little bit, but they're really busting through. That's a horrible call. Way off the mark, and that's gonna be a turnover on downs. Probably missing some reads there. Oh my gosh, we got it back, but they already scored, so we're gonna have to score quick and get it back. Hit the post. Oh, but I get a hit when I threw it. I don't have the strongest arm in the world, so this out route might be a struggle. This is open, though, maybe? I just put too much air under it. Give me a different play than this. All go is fine. Tight end seam is not the call at the moment. I see he is rattled over there. Okay, so it's very specific. That's interesting. Throwing a bullet. And he's got it. Cool. That was my hot route, too. I don't think we're going to win this game, but I've had fun. Really bounced back here in my debut. Oh. That's picked off. Yep, yep. We're not having fun anymore. Rip. All right, two interceptions. And that'll do it. Finally able to get on the field, but I am not victorious. That's fine. We had some positive plays. Definitely some negative ones. Interesting to see Pennington here. Cole Pennington won the battle, even though we didn't see it play out. Only getting to see me play. That one was hype, though. My first touchdown. My debut game, I had 236 passing yards, two touchdowns, two interceptions. Oh, there it is. I'm QB1. It took a long time to get here, but now the road to glory truly begins. Three years of eligibility left. What will I do with it? Find out next time on Road to Glory.